My name is Robert Dafford. I'm from Lafayette, Louisiana. I've been painting murals for, well, since about 1970. And I became a historical mural painter in uh, the late 70s, by accident, actually. I'm from South Louisiana, and I got a commission to do a painting about the Acadian exile for the Acadian village. You know the Acadians as the Cajuns, but uh, there it's a, everything is Acadian and Acadiana. And I, in researching to do, trying to figure out how to portray those people, I ended up learning a lot about how to research and paint historical paintings and soon got commissions to do more historical murals. And I've worked all of my first works like that were in Washington State, Vancouver Island, Steubenville, Ohio, and then other places around South Louisiana. This project was started by a group called Legacy. Legacy is a young business person's branch of Forward Quest, which is the Northern Kentucky Economic Development people who have plans for this entire riverfront for decades into the future. And public art and a park here is a part of that. So this project was started as a way to bring public art into this area, to bring more people into this area, make it a more pleasant walking place. So we, I helped them organize a group uh, which included some historians, some um, lawyers and doctors and all kinds of characters. Uh, and we first came up with a set of um, subjects. What would be 50 subjects that would be important to uh, Covington history? And there were two historians on our panel, Dr. Carl Lietzenmeyer and uh, Dr. Joseph Gastrite, both Covington residents. Everyone on the committee and everyone involved in producing this project, all of the volunteers and the people who worked on it are all Covington people and all of the scenes have to do with Covington history. The first important documented fact of, uh, of a large activity happening here was uh, George Rogers Clark, Simon Kenton, Daniel Boone, and Colonel Braddock all met here, 1782, to have a meeting with approximately 1,500 militia settlers, uh, volunteers who came from the whole region to go and prosecute Indian wars in the region. And uh, it's the only time that these four characters met. Um, this guide, of course, no matter who you are or how important you are, without information, you have, you have nothing. This guide, in, uh, uh, he was a scout and came and uh, he just appeared in this painting. It was an interesting thing for me. It was a time in my life when I needed a guide too. And this guy just kind of appeared. And the, the, the process of finding a reenactor who had um, authentic hardware and clothes and all of these things was just a, a wonderful uh, boon for me in doing this painting. He's also a George Rogers Clark reenactor. And it was a lot of fun to work with this and it changed somewhat the way that I feel about my painting. 